Good day everyone and welcome back to DX Explorer for another video. In the today's video we have a quick review of the Kaiwitz KET SO2 Intelligent Electric Soldering Iron. You already know I'm a big fan of the Kaiwitz tools so I just received uh, this soldering iron for a quick review. So um, let's have a quick look. I'm going to open the box really quick. Actually, I'm pretending I'm opening the box. I already opened it about a week and a half ago. But it's just for you to see what we have in here. So uh, it comes with a um, user manual. And uh, we have the soldering iron right here. Oops. Very nice soldering iron. Very small. It's not bigger than a marker. And it feels very, very comfortable in, in your hand. So you know the favorite part is taking this off for the second time I have my fingerprints <laughs> uh, on the screen already uh, over here we have a, a cap which is hard to take out and in here we have one of the soldering tips I received a couple of uh, other soldering tips different shapes and sizes I'm going to show you in just a little bit it's very 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 easy to uh, place this one inside if you want to change the soldering tips place it inside you screw the uh, this holder on and once you finished and the the soldering iron cool down you just put the cap back on and you're done it's really really nice i like it It's fantastic. <laughs> okay, now let's talk a little bit about the soldering iron. What else we have in the package? Let me take the box out of the way. In the package, we also have this. Uh, USB-C to USB-C uh, charging cable, well charging cable, power cable, which uh, it comes with this very very nice leather um, strap and I really like this one. I haven't used this cable by the way, I used my phone cable to use the to use the soldering iron so I'm going to open this one for the first time. It has protection on both ends, a plastic protection. The cable seems really nice and strong. I really like this. And uh, we also have a nice holder for the soldering iron. And it sits like this. Oops, this way. So as I was saying, it's very beautiful. It's very comfortable in the hand. Um, it's not very heavy, it's very light actually, so it's easy to work with. And uh, quick specifications on the soldering iron. It has a power of 65 watts. And it has a nice OLED screen, uh, 0.87 inch. The power is between 9 volts up to 20 volts. And it has a USB-C type charging port. Uh, the working, working temperature is between 80 up to 420 Celsius degrees or if you're uh, from US is between 176 up to 788 Fahrenheit. Over here we have a nice charger. Seems like a really strong charger. I've been using this one for my phone as well <laughs> lately and it's uh, charging my phone really really fast. Um, the charger has 65 uh, watts and you can use it between 100 up to 240 uh, volts i think it has an automatic switching system uh, between 5 volts 9 volts 12 volts 15 and 20 volts um, i like it over here you have a usb c uh, type uh, charging port for a, for a cable and here you have a regular USB um, charging port. Anyway, 
to power your soldering iron basically you would connect your cable to the charger plug it in and then you will connect the other end of the cable into the soldering iron all right so i started uh, powering the soldering iron over here as you can see you get to change the temperature 310 i'm gonna go down to 270 maybe 280 i have this um, ic socket that i want to solder on some uh, nice board that i received from my friend andre yankee oscar 6 tango julia juliet for an am uh, receiver that i want to build for my mom so we're going to do a quick test and uh, solder this ic socket and see how well it works okay well i um, set up the temperature to about 270 uh, celsius degrees and uh, this is usually one of the temperatures that i like using somewhere around uh, 270 up to 300 celsius degrees just because there are small pads to solder and i don't want to heat up the pcb board excessively um, of course i've been using this one for uh, nearly a week now so i'm already happy about the way it works i'm just gonna finish soldering right now and uh, show you the finished board and here we are it's fantastic i'm really happy about the way it works and uh, i still can't believe i can get this from a usb port okay so here we are on the product page on the kaiwitz website um, a lot of details on the page down below you have the description of the product product specifications in case you want to double check before you buy it we have a package list and uh, manuals download and we also have a firmware if you want to update the firmware on the product and uh, over here you have a couple of extra things that you can order with your uh, kaiwitz uh, soldering iron in my case it arrived with this extra set of uh, soldering iron tips and of course uh, you have to check which plug you're ordering it with you can use between us plug uk plug european plug or australian plug uh, you have this ny15 uh, discount code for the new year 15% um, off by the time you're watching this video in case that one is no longer available you can always use the dx15 um, code and you get 15% off and you get extra 5% off if you spend um, over $50 and extra 10% off if you're spending over $100 so it's great deals um, you should check it out and I would really recommend you this soldering iron kit I really like it okay so here we have the entire package one more time we have the soldering iron we have the holder with the sponge and of course the nice cover for the soldering iron we have the extra tips that you can order a very well made uh, usb to c to usb c uh, cable to power it on and of course a powerful 65 watts charger excellent package i would really recommend you this one and of course don't forget the user's manual because it's very important you have a lot of uh, menu settings a lot of playing around with the buttons to get into some particular settings and optimize the menu and the soldering iron for the way you like to use it of course the best uh, thing is that it's portable thanks to the usb-c uh, adapter for the for the power and uh, that is helpful because it's great to use it when portable i wish i had this one last year when i was installing uh, solar panels for my friend and i really needed a soldering iron to uh, do uh, little connections of the electrical equipment and uh, i wish i had this but i didn't <laughs> Um, the idea is that uh, even for amateur radio portable operations sometimes things break when you're in the middle of nowhere 
and you have no electricity available and the portable soldering iron kit is fantastic so i guess i will build a nice uh, rechargeable battery pack with lipo batteries uh, probably something with a voltage regulator so i can get somewhere around 15 volts and uh, with an output uh, that has a usb-c so i can connect the cable to the soldering iron and i get to use it portable which i think it's a fantastic thing to have so definitely this one will stick into my backpack every time i will go portable uh, either for amateur radio or other <laughs> um, occasions when i go to help friends and uh, fix a couple of things in the places where i don't have electricity available so anyway i hope you like it as much as i do i really like it and i hope uh, if you buy yours you'll be also enjoying it as much as i do all i can say is uh, thank you kaiwitz for this uh, great product and uh, to you i will say 73 and until next video have an amazing rest of the week.